Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Garrett, and welcome back to Resident Evil Village on the Xbox Series X. Ooh. Ooh, another statue. Eh, eh, last episode we uh, took on a huge giant and got ended up killing him. Getting a lot of goodies. Right before we were getting ready to head up to the next main area, we decided to take a side path. Uh, we also learned that the mold is all over the, uh, underneath of the village. There was still something in there. I couldn't find anything. I'm not 100% sure. Um... Oh, come on. There we go. We also cooked a meal up with uh, Duke. We now have permanently much larger health than what we had. Fish. Really use a fish. I don't think I don't think I have enough to make anything, but we do have some treasures we could sell him. Oh, hold on here. I haven't seen one of those in a while. How much? What? How much does it cost to make uh, sniper ammo? Two gunpowder. Ooh, it uses a chem fluid. Nah. Not interested. But thank you for the offer. I need to keep my chem fluid. Look at my bullets we have. Let's see how quickly we go through those. I'm sure Duke will be in the next area as well, so I'm not going to... I'm not going to backtrack right now. Another treasure. I'm hoping there's another labyrinth puzzle somewhere. Ah. <laughs> oh. Okay, you. You. First, I know there's more of you around here. Yeah, you. We have, like, our weapons right now are sitting pretty. We have some great weapon upgrades on right now. Did that health count? Okay, it did. I was like, where'd that sniper go? Found him. I know we killed a guy up here. Did we get that money?
What? There we go. And mine. Bullets. Scrap metal. Always a welcome thing. Tim. There we go. I do like they put a little distance on picking stuff up, so in that situation, you don't have to be like right on top of it. Handgun. Hand. Oh my god. Look. I know the game likes to give me things, and I'm not being. Overly um, picky here. I'll take what I can get. But if I can I trade in this door open, if I can trade in some of these handgun bullets I'm finding right now for shotgun, I'd be a happy camper. Hoo hoo! I'll take those too. too soon. It seems like it's going to be a losing fight if I'm not careful. Oh, there it goes. I just had to wait longer. Figured I was like, well, shit, now I don't know what to do. But the plan was to open up both doors, pull both handles. Not so much. Oh, thank God. Box here. Ugh. 
Got a pathway that way, and that seems to be the only way to go. This must be their den. I gave that away. View. Honestly, now I can see why they put a safe spot right behind us. This area is crazy. They, the onslaught doesn't stop. Oh, I, I actually had some herbs. It really doesn't stop. I'm just... I'm floored. So I, I cleared out quite a down. few. I cut out a, a, a part in between here. Many deaths, and they were all in my favor. Good lord. I was able to clear out the first wave. Then wave two showed up and yep. Set me on my way. Pretty helpful. Okay, big guy. Oh, boy. There's a guy in front of me. What, I say, I said, what about 25 ammo? <laughs> this 
Throw the crust. funny he thought he was being all big and bad there I'll get him pow <laughs> Woo. that was crazy did not expect that I kind of want to go back there to go see if there's any items I can quickly grab. Because I am really in need of something. Granted, I mean, I'm okay on ammo and stuff, but I went in there with like, what, 90 some, 50? It was, I don't know, a lot. A lot of bullets. question is, are they endless? Like, will they just keep coming if I'm in here? Or do they already screw off? I mean, I'm not seeing anybody in here. Okay, let's skirt the place. Ooh, look at that. Money. Still stuff on the bottom floor. First aid, pipe bomb. So I, speaking of first aid, it kind of dawned on me. They actually got rid of the different levels of first aid. It used to be like small, was it small, medium, and large, or just small and large? Which I'm fine with, and it doesn't matter to me. But I'm pretty sure there was a large med kit at one point. Okay. What else we got up here? So eerily quiet now. Boy, I spoke too soon. Bye. There's something back in the the save room that we missed. I swore it showed that big round area that we came in at as a uh, bread. Totally is possible. I mean, it's I kind of just saved and ran. Yeah, it's still red in here. We we got something hanging around. Very curious as to what. Technically, it could be in that hallway as well. No? Okay. Well, on that note, I think that's a great place to pause it. We will continue our journey in the next episode and go deeper into the layer here. So thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you can, give the video a like. It does help me out quite a bit. 
Also, check out the channel because I have tons of videos going on over there. And until next time, you guys, stay frosty.